Hey everybody, today we're taking a break from my cross country road trip. This is my first time filming since I have returned home. Today is Sunday, August 12th. I know I don't usually go out on weekends. I have been really into themed sales on whatnot. I know August 24th, 25th, I should have probably looked at my calendar before I started this, but I know I have two days of cat train. Uh, I have another whatnot sponsored train I'm doing, which is Halloween themed and Halloween's not usually my thing. And you know, I take my themed sales very, very, very seriously. And I have poodles and pink, pink, pink. I mean, <laughs> there's a lot going on. So I decided to go out and look for some specific items today. Let's go in and see what we can find. stop look at this pillow let's twist <sighs> so cute $13 as is oh, I haven't had the most luck with decorative pillows and I already see it says as is what is going on here mid-century lucite trivet $11 and 30% off I'm probably gonna have to pick that up on principle I'm just gonna go through the rest of this booth first make sure there's oh beaded flowers one of my favorites um they're a little bit steep for my purposes though whoa this looks like it would probably glow no right maybe art glass is it signed not really my thing but really unique this is a cool little metal enamel mid-century piece well these are really interesting sweden Huh. 32. Black wood Sweden candle holders. Interesting. Those would be fun in a Halloween sale. I wish they weren't missing as much paint. I want to make sure to keep my costs low. Especially for things that have any damage. If they were a little bit less or had a little less paint loss, I'd probably pick them up though, honestly. Gosh. Stuff. I'm so uh, out of practice. Those are cool. I've just been kind of standing here staring. There's a lot of stuff that I see that I'd like to pick up, um, but I do get this weird sense like I'm missing something. Old Howard, although the rooster set has never been the best selling for me. Bovano, cool. What's this little, is this like a cactus? <laughs> Iridescent cactus ring holder. That's cute. Uh, that's cool. And I love the clock. Oh my gosh, what's happening here? Vintage. I don't know what that says. What happens when I open it? Oh, that's so cool. $8.30% off. I can't leave that. And it's in really good shape. It's so unique. I love stuff like this. Well, I was going back for that butterfly trivet when I caught this out of the corner of my eye. Oh my gosh. What? Dude, that is sick. 24 and 30% off. Looks like it's in pretty good condition too. Well, it comes to like $7.70 after the discount. It's really cool. Eh, I'm going to get it. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet. It's kind of Halloween-y colors. <laughs> but again, like I said, I want to make sure I have enough tightly themed stuff. Now this purse, I my gut is telling to pick this up because it is just cool all the way, man. It comes like $17, like $16.70 or whatever after the discount, which is a little bit more than I'd like to pay, but it's in really good condition. It's incredibly unique. I mean kind of seems irresistible honestly this is cool too this jar that would cost a fortune to ship though wait what's happening here mid-century hand-blown hand jar wait that's so cool so you guys see this is how it happens i've picked up a bunch of stuff already and it has nothing to do with what i'm looking for but still i love the little wait what does this say more than ever, they need 
their quart a day. That is so cute. $9 for, oh, I'm not even in the picture. <laughs> it's a little milk jar. It's got a little bit. This is cool. All right, let me stop. I'm getting distracted. Whoa. Speaking of distracted, that is cool. Mid-century copper and gold compote. It's like trees meets starburst pattern. Oh my gosh, my glasses are gonna fall off. I'm sweating so hard, they're like falling down my face. <laughs> All right, well, I'm back at this booth, just like I said I would. Uh, I think, even though this is really nice, I think it might be newer than I want. Owl is still my favorite, but again, no price. And I do think that is one of the newer ones, so it's not worth going out of my way for. I don't think they sell for that much, honestly, but the prices here are usually pretty reasonable. Looks like somebody bought that hanging clown lamp that we liked so much and they finally, looks like, did they finally turn the price around here? No. Oh, I can't believe someone bought the clown lamp. That thing was so cool. Um, I keep thinking I'm making excellent time and I forgot how big this place is. I'm trying to go for this elephant. Ah. 25. That's an awesome one. I can't lie, I kind of can't take it anymore. I really want to know how much that tiger lamp is. I think I'm going to take this into my own hands. I'm grabbing a yardstick. Well, the yardstick was well worth it. I'm pretty sure that it says $25. So, looks like I'm going to have to find someone for ladder purposes. Oh, so freaking cool. All right, so as I make my way up to the front, 15 bucks, what? I wonder if that glows a little. I kind of feel like for 15 bucks, that's, uh, that's, that's really cool. <laughs> I feel like there's no way I'm gonna lose money on that. Might as well throw it in the Halloween sale, right? Um, some amber glass shoes. That is exciting moth tin. That's kind of cool. Three bucks. All right. Why not? Might be crazy, but that might even be Blanco glass. Wish I knew more about it. I'm also looking at this Dolly Dingle situation happening. 20%. Oh, banana. Oh, the recipe book's so cute. The funky fish coasters, those are fun. Again, nothing to do with what I'm looking for, 23. Okay, we can let that go. Do you think we're gonna be able to spot with this Holt Howard? Oh yeah, it says 50 bucks. Look at those swizzle sticks, those are weird. The Holt Howard Cats is what I was going for, but at $50, there's definitely not much I can do with that. It's about retail. Um, sometimes they even go less for that, depending on condition. Well, a lot of the times they go less for that, depending on condition, I should say. That's unusual, isn't it? Hollywood Regency makeup mirror, I love that. Um, dude, what? How is this just sitting here? Does anyone not know what this is? Who cares that it has a chip? Chrome dresser jar this top is bake light four bucks excuse my language but hell yeah uh, the other thing i'm seeing is this little snowflake flake glass i'm thinking about picking it up for christmas it's got little paint laws it's really far away i'll probably lose interest and wonder why i bought it by then ceramic ghost six bucks there's all kinds of halloweeny stuff in here this is so fun a lot of it is new and the music is pretty loud over here considering how broken my microphone is. Whoa. Huh. Let me um, focus, focus gate. Oh, I love these. Hazel Atlas, if I'm not mistaken, I can't remember. The five bucks each. Ah, so distracted. And then look at, oh my gosh, what's happening here? Sixty firm. What? 
feel like that's a really good price. Well, I think I am going to go ahead and grab one ghost. This one's only $6 and I like the size of it. I really wish the price tag wasn't pulled over on that, turned over on that celluloid doll. This little chocolate box is amazing. I also see 20% off all items. I think I'm going to need to get the key for this. Already distracted by my favorite booth of all time. I have to remember, I'm not buying stuff for myself. Oh my gosh, that card though. Dude, what? Oh my gosh. I want that so bad. And look at this vintage bathing suit. Oh my gosh, play suit. So cool. Oh, but all of this, I know it's a little spendy, but it's so, so worth it. All right, so here's another thing happening. Oh my God. Sitting on a shell. 1920s flapper, 65, 20% off. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, I need to finish up. I've taken a picture of this booth. Would I ask, oh my gosh. Aiming to please, oh, I shouldn't have come here. I should have saved this for the last. Lucky strike. Oh my gosh, I'm so distracted. I need to stop. I'm never gonna leave this booth and I don't have much time. Like all of these. Dude, what? Stop, stop, stop. I can't look at this anymore, it's too much. It's so much of the stuff I like. Okay, so this actually seems like a lot to pay, but I've never seen them before. These Norcrest Owl Salt and Pepper Shakers. I think I might grab those. They're $24, but 10% off. Oh my gosh, don't let me look at stuff like this. Um, what are these? Wait, stop. 20% off all items. These are so weird. $6.40. Oh, those are very cool. I kind of have to get those. Now these trade cards too are very interesting. I feel like I've completely lost my purpose. <laughs> now I'm just like, okay, we'll pick up whatever. Um, this one is really interesting to me in this little frame, the pills ones. Oh, that's very cool. And uh, this one, that's very cool. So I am gonna get these for sure. I'm gonna Google these plates along the way to make sure I want both. I'm definitely gonna take at least one of them. Let's see what else we can find in here. What is this thing? 45, that's cool. Okay, but also look at these little glass bottles. The man and woman, it looks like Betty Boop almost. 28 for a pair, I kind of love that. Oh, flower, oh, that's cool. I wish I had seen that for the flower power sale. I meant to come out here for that, but I just didn't have enough time and energy, honestly. Well, again, nothing to do with what I'm looking for, but this little Irwin plastic doll is only five bucks. Oh, I'm starting to unwind a little. Wait, 50% off? D8, no, this is not the same one. D5, this is confusing actually. Very confusing. D, I don't understand at all. This is, we'll have, August will have 50% off. I can't make sense of this sign. Or are there two different tags going on in here? This is confusing. No, there's like no information that's relevant to me here. Or maybe I'm just hot and crazed, I can't tell. Not including firm. Okay, so this is $29, still a really good price. I see a little 
maybe a little bit of damage. Oh, I'm so tempted to pick it up anyway, but that's a little bit more than I'd like to pay for my poodle sale, which I completely forgot about until just now. I know I was thinking about it when I walked in. I feel like I haven't seen many poodles. I'm glad I scheduled it at, and far enough that I'll probably still have time to hopefully find them. I see them all the time, and I feel like ever since I scheduled it, I haven't seen any. <laughs> Well, I don't have much time left. I only have a couple minutes before I have to go back to the booth that I want to get into the cases. Oh my gosh. Firm, firm, firm. Okay, cool. We can let that go. What is the situation here? Look at all these fish. Nine dollars. Don't mind if I do. Again, nothing to do with what I'm supposed to be doing. Nine, eight. Um, very cool. I love this tin, by the way. Eight, that's really cool. Wait, 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 wait. Nine. Uh, yes, please. All right, I'm putting my basket down. I'm about to go nuts. What's the situation here? Wow, these are amazing. Six dollars. Love the texture on them. Again, nothing to do with what I'm looking for. Look at this stuff. 20. The prices here are so good. 20. Maybe I should pink up the pink ones. This one's really cool. Let me do a little homework right quick. I don't know, man. These might be a little close. I love this one, though. only 10 percent it's not 20 that's probably too close for me oh whoa wait hello eight dollars shut the front door sold okay also but can we talk about what's happening here i thought it was ceramic turns out it's glass and it looks like i don't know what's going on there but i'm getting it six oh my gosh i'm really nervous about that actually I also went ahead and uh, picked up that one. Gosh, that's cool. I'm about to run out of time. Of course, I'm seeing this now. These are really hard to find. $6 sold. What is this weird one? $4. That's kind of cool. Nine. Fair price. Whoa. Hold up. What's happening here? These, I feel like, are something. I feel like these are something. And it's escaping me now, and I think if I leave them here, it will drive me nuts. 22, so 20. I think I'm gonna take them. 20 for the pair. I think these are Polish. Gosh, maybe I can text Jess. Maybe she knows. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm freaking out. All right, I'm gonna have to hurry up. Seven, five. Oh my gosh. Eight. All right, so of course I ran out of time, as always. Um, I am gonna ask them if they can open this case for me. This is B6CK. I kind of feel like I need this. I don't know if I'm gonna sell her yet. But for $65 and 20% off. Um, she's got damage. She's paper mache though. Oh my gosh, I don't know if I can leave this. I'm just holding on to it at this point. I'm so nuts. Why did I come here with no time? Ah. So I ended up spending $341 in there. Uh, probably about a hundred of it, maybe a little less. A little less is for myself. I'm definitely keeping this lamp. I'm honest to God, probably keeping that uh doll I found. She's just so amazing and I have such a weakness for stuff like that. So I didn't find as much as I was hoping for for the theme sales coming up but luckily I hope I have enough time to fill those spots and I will see you guys tomorrow. I don't know what state I'm in tomorrow. Maybe Oklahoma? I don't know. I guess we'll find out.